focus camera. Number seven, um, foundation. It's really, really good, and I use this to apply it. Because I find it easy to apply with my Max Factor, like, um, sponge, because I prefer it. So what I do is I squeeze a bit on, only in a tiny bit of time. Oh, that was a bit much, as I said, so. So now I'm just going to bring the mirror up to me. And I'm now going to put my makeup on. So I start off down here because you need to blend it all into your face. So that's all blending in nicely. I'm sorry about the lighting. It's not the best lighting. But I just have to do it in this lighting because that's the only lighting I've got. And I'm not in my usual place to record. I'm actually in my living room. But there's a mirror behind me that I could have used, but I'm not tall enough to look in it, so I've had to, you know, I'm going to sneeze by the way. I don't want to sneeze. So if I hold it in my nose and it looks stupid, and I do apologise. I've got a bit of a bug in that nose today. Alright. Alright, i really twitch your nose. I'm so sorry. Disappeared. Disappeared. Disappeared like from the face of the earth. I'm sorry about that. I'm sorry it's sneezing in the video. And I do apologise. My friend is so annoying me. I'm trying to grow it out and it's really annoying me. Oh, I've got a really twitchy nose. Oh dear, my eyes are all twitchy today. So I'm just literally going over all. Oh, I would use my concealer, but I lost that a long time ago, so I can't um, use it. I'm going to put some down on my neck as well. That. It doesn't look stupid. I like doing my makeup because it makes me feel girly and I am really girly. I'm a really girly girl. So I am a really girly girl with all my girly stuff. I'm really good at girls. Oh, there's a line there. Don't leave a line on your makeup because it looks absolutely hideous and you don't want it too thick either. I tend to make it quite thick, so, and I'm not supposed to because it's not something that I call good. Right. So that is my fans. I just need to check my foundation in there. Right, that is my foundation. I just need to get some out of my nail in a minute. Just off oh, sugar. She never done that. Anyway, now to my eyeshadow. Now my eyeshadows aren't normal eyeshadows, they are eyeshadow shimmers. So this is my eyeshadow shimmers, if I can find them. They're like eyeshadow shimmers, so you look like this. They look like this, and inside is, some of them have like disappeared and they've been used. But it's hard to anything left in them, but there's a shadow shimmers. And I'm gonna use just a normal brush. Well, I say normal, it's not a normal normal brush. Let me find that right. I'm trying to find it, I can't find that. Gonna use I'm kind of really isn't focusing. Gonna use this brush. And the colour I'm gonna use is blue. Because I really feel like a bluey colour today. So I'm gonna use the blue. And I'm now going to apply it onto my eyelids, but I need to try and open up a bit, 
because I put on so much weight, but like, you know, not as wide. I'm trying to open them up with bright colours. My fringe is really annoying me. I'm literally just going over. Oh, I don't really want to. Sorry about that. Really going over it really well, putting those on the brush because the more the merrier. I'm not brilliant at like um, eyeshadow, I just bung it on any other way. It shouldn't be done like that, but. Right, that's that one. Now I'm gonna mix it in a minute with a bit of. I'm gonna mix it in a minute with a bit of um, silver. Just to give it some more texture. Lighting so bad that I can't even see what I'm doing. Yeah, you're still recording on your camera. Yeah. So now I'm going to mix it with a little bit of a silver one just to give it a bit of like ink and a bit of like mixed colours so I'm actually just putting in a bit of, a bit of silver to just go do my eye makeup so I don't do this perfectly because I'm not a perfect person so no one's perfect, they might think they are, but they're really not. That didn't really show on that eye, so I'm going to put a bit more on. I'm going to have to get some more makeup, because I'm running out of it. Put it over creases of your eyes. For that. Is my eyeshadow. I am now going to put on my mascara. Like I said, I don't use. Oh, it's gone over my hands. I don't use an awful lot of. I don't use an awful lot of makeup. Because I don't want to look like plastic, and that says something. So that is just um, going to use my mascara. So I'm just gonna put it like this. And put my mascara once I can get it open. And my lipstick, I just use a. For my lipstick in a minute, I'm just going to use it as my lip liner. And that is, I know people put it in with lipstick, but I tend to just leave it with just lip liner because I think it lasts a whole lot better. I will put on top, put on first my lip balm and then I will put on my um, lip liner so I keep on quite a bit of mascara just to open up my eyes just to really really open my eyes because they're really quite because I put on weight well because I put on weight all these years I needed to make my eyes look wider so the more I put on The best one. I put on really quite a lot of mascara just to open my eyes up. I'm gonna start wearing makeup an awful lot more. Might even wear it to work tomorrow. Whoops, got a bit on my nose. Okay. 
So that is my mascara. I will do a close-up of all this in a minute. It's just something that I want to do just to show you. So now I've got my lip liner and yeah, it's in my shade. I don't really know what shade this is. It's just like a really dark, like pinky red. Oh yeah, first one I'm going to put on some lip balm and it's my black currant one and it's my Babylon. Babylon. So this for camera is not focusing today. My Babylon. So I'm just literally going to smother this all over my lips. And so I'm a bit sniffly. I keep on sneezing, you know. That is on my lips. Because it gives it the texture. And it might it might feel a bit weird on your lips because it's very it's very like very like you know flimsy. So now I'm gonna go over. You might think why did I open it on after? Is to give the texture of the lip liner a better chance of sitting on it. It may make you think greasy, but it doesn't really matter. It really doesn't matter how much you use this. I use it as my lipstick. I know it sounds stupid. But it's really nice. And really moisturising. And with it having it on the lips. So the moisturising lips first. It makes it really easy to apply. It just absolutely slides on. It literally slides on. And it looks like this. Now, this is going to sound really strange and it's not meant to, but I always thought that this, that this thing was a eyeshadow was it no was a blusher and I always use it as my blusher and it's actually an eyeshadow so don't take the mick out of me but I use it as my blusher because I haven't got any blusher and I really like it. So this is just gonna use this brush. I'm just going I've already bent this brush. Gonna use quite a bit, not too much just to make you look plastic but I'm going to use enough to fill my lip. If you can fix a car, then you can learn to fix it. Enough to make me look nice. A Pacific 24 C boat, a four and a half inch naval gun, a Samson radar system, or a Type 45 destroyer. And when you can fix all that, you'll be a Royal Navy engineer. Just enough to make me look girly and really nice. Put some on here, just to lighten it up. So this is my all day every makeup. Now I would do my eyebrow pencil, which the lids off again. So I'm just going to literally show you my eyebrow pencil. It looks like that. I don't know if I'm gonna do my eyebrows on this effect, but I'm just going. I'm going to go over them. 